My name is Clinton Kirkpatrick and I'm down with Belfast Central Mission today um, via Eastside Arts um, over in East Belfast. Um, we've been doing a little bit of kind of uh, mosaic or cutting and pasting with the group. So we've been here for a, uh, for a couple of weeks working on our mosaic pieces. So I brought this by way of an example um, of cutting these kind of like tiny, uh, tiny pieces out and sticking them onto the, the background. This kind of small project was really getting people thinking about um, how to use color, um, about kind of like cutting and pasting small pieces and sort of arranging those um, on a canvas space. This type of activity, um, working with older people, um, sort of helps in many different ways. Really, it gets older people thinking about colour and using their mind about how to kind of use colour differently against each other, like comparing and kind of uh, different tones and stuff. And also kind of, you know, physically, um, people can be sitting, um, kind of cutting and pasting and moving, and they're active, you know, people have had to reach over to get things or they're interacting with, with people beside them. So it kind of encourages dexterity and um, thinking around how to do things on an intricate level. You'll find that these spaces are about the sort of community space as well. So. What I really feel as the facilitator coming in is, you know, you're, you're working with this group of people that are laughing and getting on, they all know each other and it's fun and everybody's interacting and there's a lot of kind of community spirit in the room. I always love coming in and working, especially with older people, because it is full of storytelling, um, it's full of fun and like literally the sessions have just been hilarious and I've been laughing the whole time. So it's, it's different, they're easy, but they are often very, very fun. ECM has been running a weekly lunch club here from the 1950s where people come in and enjoy a lunch and a chat with their friends. We had to close last year because of the pandemic and people have really noticed from we reopened in June this year how lonely and isolated they were in their own homes. By coming here each week it has built their confidence up, built their self-esteem up and they really have something to look forward to each week. Today they're enjoying some arts and crafts and it really gives them something to think about and get their minds working and they have stated to me how much they've really enjoyed it.